Hello, I'm so glad that you're back. I'm going yeah. to be reading a story today. Not really a story necessarily um, in the once upon a time sense of story, but it is definitely an imaginative story. Have any of you seen this book before? It says, what if you had animal eyes? Now this is one that we got from our scholastic book order a while back. And this is written by Sandra Markle and illustrated by Howard McWilliam. And I really am appreciate their imagination as they wrote the story and also the interesting things that I've learned from the story. I don't have time today to read the whole entire book, but I wanted to choose just a couple of the wonderful animals that are highlighted in the story, and it kind of goes along with our weird animals that we've been learning about, so I hope that you enjoy our video. What if one day when you woke up, the eyes on your face weren't yours? What if overnight a wild animal's eyes took their place? What if? The first animal I'm going to read about is the chameleon. Remember our story, Hyde Clyde, that we read in our classroom? It's just like him. A chameleon's eyes stick out like twin telescopes. These cone-shaped bumps are actually fused together eyelids that are open just enough to peek through. This limits the chameleon's view, but these eyes can do something tricky. Each eye moves separately. That way, the chameleon can look for prey, such as crickets, in two directions at once. You see the real chameleon there? Oh, there's another picture underneath my finger. Fact. When a chameleon spots its prey, it focuses both eyes on it, and that way it doesn't miss catching a meal. So the next page says, if you had chameleon eyes, you could look around the, around the toy store really fast to find exactly what you want. Can you imagine having chameleon eyes in a toy store? All right, I'm going to read you another one that goes along with being an eagle. And I'm actually a golden eagle from Cornerstone University. So I'm going to read you the golden eagle. What if you had golden eagle eyes? A golden eagle has laser sharp vision. This bird can see up to eight times better than most people. It can also spot its prey up to two miles away. In a flash, the golden eagle can shift its eye from focusing on something far away to something close up. This is perfect for keeping an eagle eye on and catching a fast hopping rabbit. Fact, a golden eagle's eyes have a third eyelid that sweeps across the eyes like windshield wipers, keeping them clean. If you had golden eagle eyes, you could sit up high in the stadium and still see the football game. All right, I'm going to choose one last animal to read about. If you get this book from the library, you'll have to check out all the other wonderful um, animals that are in here. I'm going to choose the bullfrog. A bullfrog's eyes are on top of its head, so the frog can hide underwater and still watch out for enemies. Its eyes are also wide apart. That way, a bullfrog can see nearly all the way around itself without turning its head. But those eyes help a bullfrog do more than just see. When a bullfrog swallows, it closes its big eyes. Its eyes sink down through openings in its skull and help push meals down its throat. Fact. A bullfrog's eyes each have a third see-through eyelid. When a bullfrog dives underwater, these eyelids slide over its eyes, the perfect built-in swim goggles. Now, if you had bullfrog eyes, a blink would let you swallow a big bite. Can you imagine if your eyes helped you swallow food? That's just like the bullfrog. Like I said, if you check this book out of the library, you'll be able to read, out, uh, read about many more animals and what their eyes are special about them.